Hi guys, I'm Unique Mirabel. Welcome back to my channel. I'm sorry I've not been posting for a while. That's because I've been very, very sick. Like, I've been very, very sick. But thank God I'm back and I'm better. I'm strong. Your prayers, your well wishes helps me, and I really appreciate you. Thank you so much. So, today, sorry, I just want to look good for the camera. So, guys, today I'll be speaking on if you see me looking down, I'm actually looking at my book. So, today, guys, I'll be speaking on reasons why the skin actually looks dull like reasons why you have a dull skin instead of it to be glowing and how you can actually achieve the glowy skin we all know that our skin actually is a protective barrier it keeps you safe from all kinds of infection otherwise you know what it means when infection gets into your body you should actually be taking precautionary measures to maintain its inner glow for instance, imagine you you stop, you know, making use of your moisturizer or whatever it is you use for your maintenance. How do you think your skin will be? It will be rough. It will be dry. You know what I mean. You won't even like your appearance. Once you stop taking care of your skin using your normal, because everybody has different um, skin types. We all know that they are different. So what, what what works for A might not work for B. That's it. It's just natural. It doesn't mean your skin is bad or this person's skin is better than your own. No. All you just need to do is know your skin type. No products that would work work for your skin. Somebody can just be using just Nivea to get a glowy skin, and it will work out fine for that person. Why you might have probably a combination skin and make use of Nivea and it doesn't work for you it doesn't do anything you might not even glow it's like that and it's not a problem everybody have different skin types so like I said for the skin we need to take precautionary measures to maintain inner glow and vitality there are ways you will maintain your skin and it looks healthy from the outside and I know you know what I'm talking about so I'll be bringing out some reasons why our skin is dull sometimes and i'll be telling you how we can actually um, achieve a glowy skin so this is just part one because i won't be here for long i'll just talk about few i'll just give few points and give the solution and in our next video i'll do the rest so now the first thing is dry and dehydrated skin i know everybody is familiar with the word dehydration now let's get to it for the skin lack of moisture makes it dry and dehydrated everybody know what the word dehydration is when it comes to health when you don't drink enough water now what i'm trying to say is the skin also needs water it needs a different kind of moisture and that's what a moisturizing lotion or a cream would do lack of dehydration makes the skin dull makes it very dry and dull and what happens when your skin is dry it can look healthy so now the solution here is make use of very good moisturizers you have to know your skin type and make use of moisturizers that are good and healthy for your skin moisturizers will definitely make your skin glow keeps your skin you know beautiful looking young glowy bump you get it so you can make use of an hydrating cleanser and a moisturizing lotion you know lotion that doesn't take away the natural oil of the skin after washing your face or taking a bath you wash your face with a very hydrating cleanser then take your bath it is important that while on damp skin you apply your moisturizer so there yeah, different kind of moisturizers you can get you can make use of oils especially oils helps to maintain moisture on the skin you get what I'm saying it helps to maintain so after making use of your moisturizer you can apply 
your body oil any body oil of your choice that suits your skin you can make use of sunflower oil you can make use of ceramides those are natural moisturizers that you can make use of on your skin especially for people that have dry skin these are not bleach and bleaching agents no it helps your skin glow makes you look so healthy so that's that about dry and dehydrated skin so i'm giving you one reason why the skin looks dull and how you can achieve a glowing skin and that is when you make use of a good moisturizer and an hydrating cleanser now we we'll move on to the next one second reason why you have a dull skin and why your skin is actually not glowing yet that's because of excess dead skin cell build up what do i mean by excess dead skin cell build up there are deaths on the skin that don't just go away just by cleansing your skin there are things you actually need to do to get rid of those dead skin cells when you have dead skin cells it will not allow your moisturizer or your body lotions or whatever you use to maintain your skin it won't allow it to be effective because of those skin cells they are actually like a dead barrier on your skin go out to carry out your day-to-day -day activities you come back home you take your bath you apply your lotion you sleep the next day you do the same thing there are some deaths that don't just go away so what do you need to do get rid of this dead skin cell i'm sure you already know what i want to talk about but it's important that we talk about it because i know some people don't understand how important it is to exfoliate your skin nobody understands how important it is to exfoliate your skin exfoliation is very very important exfoliation does a lot and number one is getting rid of dead skin cells when you exfoliate your skin you get rid of dead skin sorry dead skin cells that allows your moisturizer or lotion to do what it's supposed to do for your skin this allows you to glow naturally have you made exfoliation a part of your beauty routine <laughs> you need to actually start doing it now how do we exfoliate the skin we can make use of chemical exfoliants we can even make use of mechanical exfoliants like body scrubs i'm sure everybody know body scrub everybody know about body scrub it's not new and you know what scrub does actually it actually exfoliates the skin in short get rid of excess dead skin cell so it is important that we exfoliate the skin and when you scrub your skin you don't have to actually do it every day so as not to rip your skin off all the natural oils <laughs> you have to exfoliate if, mm, i would say two to three times every week it's better that way to keep your skin you know we just want to keep the skin looking healthy and glowy so we don't want to rip it off so you have to scrub your skin then we have um chemical exfoliants like glycolic acid citric acid lactic acid salicylic acid these are you know these are good acids that helps to exfoliate the skin it, it's more like it renews the skin getting rid of those excess dead skin cells i'll make a video showing you guys products that contains all these acids that you can try and make use of and you'll see the results it's very effective and you're gonna get a very fine <coughs> excuse me and glowy skin once you make use of all these chemical exfoliants that I've mentioned, the glycolic acid, salicylic acid, all these exfoliants are very good because it renews the skin. So it's very, very good for the skin. But one thing I want you all to know, in order for your glowy skin to stay, please and please, to actually stay away from the sun. This sun is hot and it does a lot to the skin. When you try all this chemical exfoliants that I've talked about, when you try to apply it in your skincare routine, you will see how glowy your skin becomes. Your skin will look so fine, fresh, renewed. You would, you would really love your skin because all these exfoliants can bring out your natural glow. And make sure you scrub exfoliate your skin two to three times weekly. And thank me later. So that brings us to the end to today's part on why our skin looks so dull. 
in our next part of talking about the rest reasons and solution thank you so much for watching if you are new to my channel please click on the subscribe button turn on the notification bell so you can be notified of my new video or my next video thank you so much